A Portland tow truck driver is still in the hospital weeks after he was hit by another tow truck driver while on the job. And now his friends and fellow drivers are hoping to raise awareness about the move over law, which requires drivers to slow down five miles below the speed limit or move over a lane for any car on the side of the road with flashing hazard lights. Fox 12's Drew Marine went on a ride along with drivers around Portland today. It's a fear tow truck drivers have every day when they're on the clock. A Chappelle's driver, I, within the last year or two, um, he got hit on the side of the freeway in Vancouver and he actually lost his leg. And then TLC towing down the way uh, had a driver struck and killed by a semi truck. Um, and it's just happening more and more and more. So a few weeks ago, when one of their own Northwestern towing drivers, Arthur Walker, was hit while on a job, they were devastated. When we got to the hospital, it was a, it was a tear fest. Walker had just loaded up a car and was still outside of his truck on I-84 when another tow truck driver hit him and left the scene. Portland police say the driver who hit Walker eventually turned himself in. While Walker survived the crash, he's had to have several surgeries since. He's a heart of gold, um, and I know he wants to be back out there. Obviously, it will be a long time before he's on the road, but he wants to at least be with us and be with his friends and his family. I mean, he's got a huge support here right now. Hoping to raise awareness about the move over law, dozens of tow truck drivers from Vancouver to Beaverton lit up Portland streets and freeways with their hazard lights. Uh. Jacob Best, a driver with Northwestern Towing, says those few seconds it takes to slow down or move one lane over when someone's on the side of the road can mean life or death. We help people get home, whether it's in the rain or the snow in the middle of the night. And this is my reason I want to go home. They're, they're waiting for me every day, and I, I want to go home. And if it takes you 10 seconds or adds 30 seconds to your commute by having to slow down, it means the world to us. Drew Marine, Fox 12 Oregon.